Right, well, Bamba's got something set up over here. You're going to flick the switch so we can have a look. Here we go. Right, power's on. So that's sort of set up pretty much the same sort of height yeah. and uh, distance away from the, uh, from the real edge. It looks quite close to me, so uh, we might have to make some adjustments. So we, can we adjust that flow? Can, it, can we um, make it yeah, a bit less can, of a flow? Yeah, we can slow it down a bit. Yeah. There's a danger with these water features is that you get everyone, especially on a cold day at Chelsea, you get everyone running to the loo every 10 minutes, don't you? <laughs> That's it. I've been three times already. <laughs> yeah, this is quite interesting so you can sort of see how much it's going to splash on the paving as well. Which is um, not a huge problem, but it's something that's quite, it's quite good to think about. Yeah. Okay, so this is not the actual real thing, this is plastic, and we're going to be using concrete. Is that going to make any difference to um, uh, the Yes, front? the inside surface of the uh, plastic tube we have here is obviously very smooth. Yeah. And that uh, means that there is less turbulence being created by the internal lining of yeah. this pipe. Now with the concrete pipe we have, uh, it's got a bit of a rough texture. So that will create some turbulence in the water. So what we're probably going to do is coat the inside of the pipe with some sort of a clear uh, sealant to smooth up that inner surface yeah. uh, and we'll do it to the water line so that you won't be able to see that that's what's happened to it. I see. It but also, I mean, this is, this plastic pipe, we've got um, just quite a thin edge on this, on there. And if we go over here, we've got the, this is about a two inch sort of thickness there. Is that going to make No, that difference? won't make any difference to how mm. it pours off the edge, providing oh. we can make this edge have a nice, sharp, clean edge to it. Yeah. If, for example, this got a bit too rounded yeah. or a little bit too rough, it would cause the water to stick to it and it would try and pull it right. uh, down the surface of the pipe there. But as long as we can make the, entry, uh, the exit point uh, nice, clean and crisp, yeah. the water will take off quite happily. Okay. Terrific. So, take it, it's important to remember to put attach this to the <laughs> bit when we get to yeah. Chelsea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Could you imagine? Yeah. Ooh, we don't know what's happening there. We'll be flooding Luciano's garden. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Come on, Luciano, you know you wanted a nice field. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay. So this is now set at a slightly lower level. That's much quieter, isn't it? Yeah. Mm. Interesting. Right, it's all set up. We have to ignore the battens, obviously. But that's about the height of the wall. And I think that looks fine. In fact, I think it looks better. What do you think? I agree. I agree. I think uh, it's such a weighty looking uh, nozzle that it might look a bit strange being higher up. Yeah, it's sort and of... It, um, it makes you think of uh, drainage set lower in walls anyway. Yeah. So you wouldn't have a, a drainage point high up in a wall. It's right. lower down, so it seems to make sense to me. It's really worthwhile coming and experimenting, isn't it? You're not yeah. just saying that to be polite, Bamber, are you? You're not trying to make me feel happy. I don't know what you mean, Cleve. <laughs> Oh, I think that's a that's a great I think result. It's a winner. Yeah, well worth mocking it up. Yeah. We're on. Good. We're happy with that. Yeah.